Greetings and welcome back to the Adventures of Fallon Frisky. It has been a long time. Now somehow I ended up in the Palace of Shigorath. I don't know when that happened, but we're just here. It's been such a long time, we'll just pick up and run with it. And no, I don't know the number Always of the episode. Always a pleasure. Well, look who's here. A new arrival! A shame about my gatekeeper. I'm so happy I could just... Tear out your intestines and strangle you with them. <laughs> ah, there's. I suppose an introduction is in order. I'm Sheogorath, Prince of Madness. Yeah, I played Skyrim. And thanks. other things. I'm not talking about them. That's your prerogative. Don't speak about. You've probably them. figured that out by now. Let's hope so, or we're in real trouble. And. Out come the intestines, and I skip rope with them. <laughs> but perhaps now's not the time. I give me it this far, farther than anyone else. Well done. Take this trinket of mine. Perhaps it will serve you well, or look lovely on your corpse. Okay. Charity of madness. What do you want? I've been waiting for you! For someone like you, or someone other than you for some time. I need a champion, and you've got the job! Time to save the realm, rescue the damsel, slay the beast, or die trying. Uh, Master Yoda once said... Required. Do, or do not. There is no try. A change is coming. Everything changes. Even Daedric Princes. Especially Daedric Princes. <sighs> changes? Daedra are the embodiment of change. Change and permanency. I'm no different, except in the ways that I am. Okay. A Grey March is coming, and you're going to stop it. Grey March. The details aren't important. At least, not right now. Eternity is on a rather tight deadline. We'll get first. back to that later. What now, then? Now, you run an errand for me. Yay. An important one. Delivery boy. Of course. Anything I tell you to do is important. My realm, my rules. You're going to Zedillion. One of my favorite spots in the aisles. It's a little place I used to take care of unwanted visitors. Okay. And some are more unwanted than others. Ooh, murder plot. You picked the right guy. The gatekeeper takes care of most of the unwanted, but he's dead. We'll have to remedy that soon as well. Anyway, there are those that have other ways into my realm. And they're on the move. We don't want them here. Trust me. So, you're going to get Zedillion up and running. Here's a little book to tell you how. And the Attenuator of Judgment. Uh, you'll need that too. Of course, you can always get more details from Haskell. He's a detail-oriented type of person. A big help. And a snappy dresser. Now, get going, before I change my mind. Or my mind changes me. All right. You can go now. Run along, Scoot. Details. The Mad God has given you a task. Surely someone of your copious talent should be able to handle it. Yes, quite an amazing place, really. Wonderful for relieving one's tension as you watch those troublesome adventurers suffer. No offense. 
None taken. I'd say your next move is to head to Zedillion and get it reactivated. Oh, your health. I live to serve. Alright, fine. I'll go down there, wherever there is. It's not like I particularly care, but whatever. Uh, it's Speak been a while since we've been here. Manual 2 is the deal. I've learned that in order to restore this alien, I must activate the Resonator of Judgment. To do so, I'll have to find three Focus Crystals and place them in the Judgment Nexus. Well, okay. I guess I just gotta go over there first, huh? Can I just fast travel there? Nope. Tis going to be a walk. Put one foot in front of the other, and soon you'll be walking across the floor. Put one foot in front of the other, and soon you'll be walking out the door. Okay, so it should just be over the hill here in a little bit. Should be getting really close. Ah, oh, poor puppy. Oh, yeah. I do love the blood stains on that sword, even though it faded suddenly. Not gonna lie, I've kind of missed uh, Oblivion and Elder Scroll games, even if sometimes they do drag a little bit in places. Hey, you buddy! Uh. Drain my speed, whatever. It would go away. Black picks and gold. Probably a dungeon. I've entered Zedalian. I should now begin locating the focus crystals. Ah ha ha. Alright, let's go. Uh, it's probably trapped. Gaze opened elsewhere. This thing? Yep, figured. <laughs> Hiya, buddy. Take your arrows, I don't know what they do, but take a weak poison. Sure. What was that other thing? Gold, yeah. I definitely want gold. Iron bow. It probably worth something back in town when I sell it. Judgment. That's a dead end room over there. How to get in there? I wonder. Uh, does it break? And maybe it'll open later with the button. Fireball. Keep looting you guys, but you probably got like nothing on you. Ah, you're a wizard. They say it's bad luck to kill a wizard. I don't believe that. Crystal staff, though, I'll take that. Oh, dang it, it's one of the objects I needed crystal staffs. Okay. So all the wizards have them. Opens elsewhere. Okay.
I had put that uh, silver sword in a quick select. I take slot six. Hey guys! I hate frogs. And you look like bullywogs, which. whatever. Oh, some cultist ritual. To Cthulhu, maybe. I'd prefer that over the frog god. Just give me your shit. Make sure none of them had a uh, staff. Though I think we know that they don't. Potion cowardice. Hey, staff boy. Silenced, okay. Yep, 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 yep. Yep, 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 of course. Still waiting for silence to wear off. Oh! You're dead. Uh, you're dead. Uh, there. Wait, Axe of Madness? He's got something to do with that madness or Place the third staff into the focusing crystal. Yay! Oh, sorry. Now what? Shocking. Isn't it? Yeah, I know. Pun was awful. <laughs> Idiot. What are you waiting for? Uh. That took you a while. And you're really completely stupid or just broke. I have to go everything. Yeah, make your way back, go tell she got it. Ooh, pretty. Hmm, nice. Oh, no. I had to practice with this, too. Got it. Lord Shea Gorath has sent someone to assist me. But where are my manners? <clears throat> Must get into my professional tone. <clears throat> Welcome to Zedillion. I'm the dungeon caretaker, Kiliban Nerendil. Okay, tell me about this A place. A wonder of engineering, is it not? 
Not really. Zedillion is the ultimate test of metal for the foolhardy adventurer that dares trespass into the Shivering Isles. Oh. What they don't know is that they're being drawn to their doom, courtesy of the Resonator of Judgment. Tell me more. Ever since that wretched gatekeeper was made, Zedillion became redundant. It fell into disrepair and was eventually all but forgotten. Oh, no, he After only it. a few years passed, the Grumites began moving in. Ghastly things. They Excuse mistook the clean. focus crystals for some sort of religious symbols and removed them from their rightful places. Yeah, I know. This rendered the resonator inert and Zedillion completely useless. Luckily, you came along and placed Zedillion back into operation. Luck is not an issue here. How do I get out of here? Yes, yes, I, I tend to ramble. You'll have to forgive me. If you have the attenuator, then Sheagorath must have sent you. Zedillion would normally have sent you back to the entrance when you stepped on the pad in the resonator chamber. Right. Since you're up here, I can only surmise that adventurers are already entering the dungeon as we speak. I suggest we kill them. The then. only thing we can do is let the adventurers complete a cycle through here. I'll be glad to help. Sure, what do I do? I assume Sheagorath gave you the Manual of Zedillion. Yes. You can consult it for more information, or I can provide instructions. Oh, uh, you're here. Just give me the instructions. As the adventurers make their way through Zedillion's chambers, they will encounter choices that you make in these control platforms. All you need to do is decide what becomes of the adventurers. Will you drive them insane? Or will you pull the life from their bodies? Oh, this just got fun. How do I make the choice? Simple. Wait until the adventurers are in position, and then press a button. If they survived, they will proceed to the next chamber, and so on. It's really quite ingenious. How do I know when I'm done? You'll know you're done when they lie dead on the ground, or they are out of their minds. Oh, okay. Of course. Simple. Any of their possessions you wish to keep are yours for the taking. I'll make sure you get them when you're done. Do you handle the cleanup? Well, the dead will be disposed of. Have no fear. That's my job. Okay. Those cool. that are lucky enough to merely go insane will be granted a place in the Shivering Isles as a permanent resident. Explain the choices I make. Each chamber presents two options. When you push the appropriate button, an event will unfold for the adventurers to experience. One is physically harmful, usually lethal traps or creatures, something relished by the residents of Dementia. Okay. The other choice is more mental. They are designed to make the adventurers lose their grip on reality, much like the residents of Mania. Of course, the introduction of spore gas with the mania choices helps as well. That's enough information. As you wish. Great. Chamber. I will be happy to describe each chamber and explain the event that unfolds as we proceed through Zedillion. Okay. Let's go. So good to be back in business. I think we're going to get along famously. This sounds... Like, it's going to be hilarious. <laughs> Insanity or death? Oh, I vote this. What in oblivion is that thing? <laughs> this is one of the horrid guardians of which the story spoke? Be careful. There may be more to this creature than meets the eye. What a joke. Let's be rid of this thing and continue on our way. Are my eyes playing tricks? Or is the creature By the growing? Gods, when will it stop? It could devour us. Run both. for your lives! Get back here, you cards. Something's not right. Hmm. All this time it was merely an illusion. How clever. Wait, what's wrong with Lewin? It makes no sense. Should be d dead. But what? Oh. 
I think this place got to him. Perhaps we should leave. No, we'll pick him up on the way out. He must fend for himself. I've unleashed a giant gnarl on the adventurers in Zillion. With the threat of what precedes a certain death knocking at his door, Wu and the rogue has gone insane. I should my way make my way to the next observation room and choose how the adventurers will encounter the next obstacle. Okay. Let's go! <laughs> Watching them run from the giant gnarl gets me every time. That was pretty funny. I could try to kill it, you know. Alright, let's see. Look, uh, I told you, treasure. Let's have at it, Sindelius. Hmm. I vote Death Trap this time. Drop key. Fire trap. Blast. The cage is locked. Grumok, be careful. This looks too good to be true. Damn, that wizard's ah, problem. Let's see them stop me after I rip this gate from its hinges. Grumok, no! <clears throat> Sorry, Sindelius. I don't know who built this nightmare, but if I get my hands on them... Well, one you kill. Ah, the classic fire trap. Always a favorite, especially in the colder months. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes indeed. Possibly throw at you. Hmm. Let's see. Ghost illusion. Raise the dead. This place is giving me the creeps. Ghost illusion. What? There we go. How in oblivion can I be dead? This. This is impossible. Nothing killed me. I didn't even get a chance to fight. <laughs> Tough shit. No chance to defend myself? No chance for battle? Why? Who? Impossible. This is impossible. Grimok has never lost a fight. Never. Oh. He's actually dead? Yep, yeah, he's nuts. You've made short work of the intruders. Shea Gorath should be proud to have such an efficient apprentice. It's like the now, Sith. if you'll step on the last teleporter Rule pad, of two. I will meet you in the reception chamber so we can recover your earnings. All right. Not to worry. We'll have your spoils to you in no time at all. Thanks. As is the tradition, you are to be awarded a focus crystal as a token of your fine work. What I'll have it sent that? to the palace and placed in the main hall if you wish to take a look at it. All right. Spoke of earnings? Oh, yes, of course. It seems a most unusual weapon was recovered from the orc warrior, Gromok. Never seen anything like it, but perhaps his journal can give you some useful information. Beyond that, Take whatever else you need from the recovery chest. You've earned it. You're free to go at any time, of course. Just up that hallway. Good luck to you. Ah, oh, thanks. Journal? Dust Fang. Okay. Let's take a look at it. One-handed nourishing frost damage. Okay, it's got a manuscript to go with it. Huh. 
Huh. Okay, so apparently Dusk Fang will change in the daylight. That is interesting. Apparently the sword shifts in the daylight, it becomes Dawn Fang. And if it kills enough things, it actually gets stronger. Oh yeah, of course. Before exiting Zillion, I was attacked by three unusual beings. I should ask you. Yeah, sure. Did you have anything? No. That was quite a battle. I hope you are uninjured. Uh, what were those? You've not heard the legends? How could that be? What? Those beings, as you call them, aren't beings at all. They are the soulless abominations known as the Knights of Order. Their attraction to the Resonator isn't surprising. It was built from one of the obelisks that dot the Isles they seem to have an affinity for. You must proceed to Sher Gorath at once and tell him the Knights have returned. Quickly now, go! Oh yeah, right, he's Chaos. Makes sense. He would despise order in its very nature. Okay. Well, we'll just rush back and tell him then. Speak quickly, more. Yeah. Ignore you. Auto saving. Hey. Well now, what news do you have to report? So soon? Not a surprise, I suppose. We'll get to that later. No need to burden your little brain with it now. Okay, whatever. And Zedillion, since you're standing here, I assume you've succeeded. Or you're terribly confused. Or really lacking in good judgment! All of the above. It's functioning. Wonderful! Time for a celebration! Cheese for everyone! Wait! Scratch that! Cheese for no one! That can be just as much of a celebration if you don't like cheese, true? You've run a maze sure. like a good little rat. But no cheese for you yet. Oh well, maybe a little. I've granted you a new spell. The ability to summon Haskell, my Chamberlain, to aid you in your travels. He knows a lot. More than he knows. Ooh, that could be useful. In fact, give it a try. Summon our friend to you now. I'll wait. But he's right here. Ah, our Lord has granted you the power to summon me. How wonderful for me. When summoned, I can offer advice on your current endeavor. I imagine it's up to you what to do with my wisdom. Do try to use your power sparingly. I have duties to which I must attend. Rather more important than shepherding you around, I'm sure. Oh, you're gonna love this. Okay, cool. Isn't that a hoot? I love it myself. Best part of being a Daedric Prince, really. Go ahead, try it again. He loves it! <laughs> Just one more time. All right, fine. Only because you asked so nicely. Ah, summoned again. My lord does so enjoy that, as is his prerogative. I'll assume you're done for now. I was done the first time I summoned you. Good, good. You'll need all the help you can get if you're going to defeat Jigalag and stop the Grey March. Oh, don't expect to summon dear Haskell anywhere but in the realm. He dislikes leaving my presence. I get that sometimes. Uh, the what? The Daedric Prince of Order. Or biscuits. No, no order. Yeah. And not in a good way. Bleak. Colorless. Dead. 
boring, boring, boring! And not a fan of my work, I can tell you. Hates it. Clearly. Hates me. A bit single-minded, if you take my meaning. Sure. You have seen his knights? Not the warm and cuddly sort. <laughs> not a bit of original thought in their lifeless husks. It's the walking so, chill. So, you're going to Crystal. help me stop him. Fine. How? Again with the niggling little details. Hold your tongue, or I will. <laughs> we'll get to that all in due time. For now, you've got other work to do. All right. What's An event, much? a movement, an apocalypse of sorts. Happens every era at the end of every era, which is to say, now. The Grey March comes and Jigalag walks. Or runs. I never skips, sidles, or struts. But mostly he just destroys everything around him. Eh, pretty simple. Ask? Ask? I don't ask! I tell! This is my realm, remember? My creation, my place, yeah, yeah, yeah. my rules! Look at you! No concept of what you've stumbled into. No sense of place. You don't even really know where you are, do you? Don't even care. I suppose few really do, but that's beside the point. We're going to give you a taste of where you found yourself. You're going to learn. It's Wonderland. I've already figured that out. Two halves, two rulers, two places. Meet and greet. Do what they will, so you know what they're about. The Duke of Mania and the Duchess of Dementia. Seek them out and let them show you what new Sheath is. You might be surprised. Once you understand I doubt it. what my realm is, you might understand why it's important to keep it intact. And maybe you'll make some friends along the way. That's always nice. I'll just piss Haskell off. Okay. Thanks, though, for the direction, at least. Ah, come visit again, or I'll pluck out your eyes! <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Can't take the focus crystal. Oh, well. Well, I'm going to end this episode here, because apparently we're going to have to go talk to a bunch of uh, Duke and Duchesses and whatnot, so... So until we get back on the ball and continue our adventures in the merry land of uh, Shigoroth Madness Wonderland. How may I serve? That's been this episode of Fell and Frisky. Thank you for watching. Have a good day. What the hell was that?